Harvey has a question here. How do I change the name and extension name on a hard drive? Backblaze stopped backing up one of my drives named Gallifrey because it thinks it is now named Gallifrey One with a space in between. Gallifrey Space One. In checking the info window on the drive, the drive's name is Gallifrey, but it is listed under the mount point as Gallifrey One. I've tried to change names multiple ways, and it keeps reverting reverting back to Gallifrey as the mount Gallifrey One, sorry, as the mounting point, which I think is what Backblaze is reading. Any advice? So, listener Stephen in Discord uh, had, I think, w- certainly what I would do first, which is unmount the drive, then. Remo- go into the volumes folder. So slash volumes. You can tell the finder to go there. Or you can do it in the terminal, however you want. Uh, go to the volumes, the slash volumes folder and remove Gallifrey and Gallifrey one. And uh, if there's a Gallifrey two, remove that too. These should be anything in the slash volumes folder should be empty folders. As we've talked about on recent episodes, Unix mounts drives at a folder. Right. Or at a like they you, you you create a folder and then just tell it, all right, that's where the drive should be. Um, if that folder exists, as it does in Harvey's case, almost certainly it, you know, he has a drive named Gallifrey. Mac OS says, cool, I'm going to mount that at slash volume slash Gallifrey. And then it says, oh, no, there's already a folder there named Gallifrey. Well, it's not going to overwrite it. So it says, all right, cool. No problem. Let's try slash volume slash Gallifrey one. And if that fails, it'll go to Gallifrey two and Gallifrey three and all those things all the way through. Get rid of that volumes Gallifrey folder and it will be able to mount right where you want it to mount. And then Backblaze should see it and match it and do all the magic things that Backblaze can do.